Hello students, let us see this question here. The spring block system as shown in the figure is in equilibrium. The string connecting the block A and B is cut. The mass of all the three blocks is M and the spring constant of both the springs is K. The amplitude of resulting oscillation will be. So, so this is the position here. If you will see what is the position of A, let us take. So, assume So let us take this is the natural position of this spring. So this is the this I need to remove here. Suppose this is the natural length of the spring. Now this is the position here. So now this length. So how much this length is there? This length will be equal to the elongation that is kx. And this k into x, x is the elongation of this spring and this kx is, right, the kx is responsible for balancing the 3m mass. So this kx must be equal to 3mg because this kx is responsible for balancing all the three masses together. So this kx is equal to 3mg. So from here I can say x, that is the elongation, that will be equal to 3mg upon k. So this elongation value is 3mg upon k. Okay. Now the moment the spring is cut. Okay. So this is the cut from here. So now, right. So now the natural length, you can say the equilibrium position. You can say after the string is cut, cut. new equilibrium position. of A is equal to Kx, Kx is equal to, so this is the K and now the two masses are gone, so only one mass is there, that is M, so this Kx has to balance only the Mz now, so from here I can say X is equal to Mz upon K, so now the new equilibrium position is only Mz upon K, so now let us take the new equilibrium position is this one, so this is the You can say this is the mean position or equilibrium position and this length, this length here is mg upon k. Okay. So now this block A will perform the SHM obviously. So this is the mean position or equilibrium position. So what this position will behave like? So at so this position the block is at rest. And from here it will move towards equilibrium position. So you can see since at this position, right, at this position, the block is at rest. So I will say this is the extreme position. So you can see easily you can say this is the extreme position. Why extreme position? Because at this position the block is at rest. And block comes at rest only at the extreme position. So this position must be as so this position must be acting like extreme position. Now I need to find the amplitude. So this is the mean position, this central line, and this is the extreme position. So this length, so from here to here, this length will behave like amplitude. So this amplitude, I can say uh, this total length is 3mg upon k minus this length that is mg upon k so that will come 2 mz upon k so this will be the value of amplitude so let us see which option is matching here option b is correct okay students i hope understood this question